Hey, what's up? It's KB here. So I have a one good news and one kind of a bad news for Windows users. So let's just start this with a good news first. So remember how we used to get the Windows 10 major updates, two major updates in one year. And after the release of Windows 11, Microsoft said that there will be only one major update in one year. But it looks like Microsoft is now moving its development cycle with major release to every three years which means uh, now we're gonna get one major update after three years which is a good thing remember how windows 10 major updates used to cause issues yeah there were many issues in almost every major update of windows 10 and most of the time to fix those issues we used to do a clean install which is not a good thing because just imagine doing a clean install every six months it was a little bit better in windows 11 with one major update in one year but now it is even better for three years you don't have to worry about getting any bugs error issues or anything like that you can use your windows 11 pc for three years without worrying about any major updates issues but here is a kind of a bad and maybe good news because of this change it looks like that people are expecting windows 12. so windows 11 22 h2 will be the last major update for next three years it's not 100 percent confirmed that there will be a windows 12 but as you know internet is crazy and almost every article about this new change in major updates is saying that there will be a windows 12 it's not confirmed but they are expecting the windows 12. now you may say that why is it a bad news well as you know after the release of windows 11 people got very sad because many people couldn't upgrade to windows 11 because of the crazy system requirements you need at least intel 9th gen or above cpu at least 8 gigabyte of ram secure boot tpm and there is no 32-bit a version of windows 11 so just imagine if there will be a next version of windows then there will be a new system requirements i think there will be so which is going to suck a lot yeah and there is a chance that we might see a windows 12 in 2024 because as you know microsoft said that windows 10 will be the last version of windows but recently we got the windows 11 so there can be a in a new version of windows it is not necessary that it will be a windows 12 it could be anything windows 11.12 maybe something like that if the system requirements changes even further for next version of windows then people are definitely going to move to the linux many people can't even upgrade to the windows 11 they can use windows 10 until 2025 and after that you know maybe maybe yeah, they will move to the uh, linux uh, for linux it's a good news for microsoft it's not a, a good news actually you know what microsoft should make a windows light which will work on any type of system that's the best thing they can do to make everyone happy i think that's it hope you enjoyed it guys i'm talking too much but yeah uh, the good news is that we don't have to worry about getting any issues from major updates at least for three years so yeah for three years i don't have to clean install my windows 11. that's it hope you enjoyed it if you have any questions or any suggestions please do the comment and that's it i will see you in the next one take care of yourself and have fun bye bye